Question 16. Derek buys a house for £150,000 and he sells the house for £154,500. We're asked to work out Derek's percentage profit. In order to work out his percentage profit, I need the actual profit. And the actual profit, hopefully everyone can work this part out, will be 1,000 or 150,000 take away let's try that again 154,000 so what he sold the house for eventually take away what he paid for the house and that's going to equal 4,500 so he's, he's made 4,500. What percentage of the original price was that? The percentage profit will equal the actual profit over the original amount multiplied by 100. That's the percent, that's the profit as a fraction, and then multiplying it by 100 will give it um, as a percentage. So let's just see it in action here. Right, so we have 4, 5, 4, 5, 0, 0, over 1, 5, 0, 0, 0, 0. So that's what it is as a decimal. So multiply it by 100 to turn it into a percentage. He's made 3% profit. 3% profit. Okay, he invests 154,500 for two years at 4% compound interest. Now, compound interest is where you get interest on your interest. Work out the value of the investment at the end of two years. The amount is equal to the principal, what you invest. Okay, the principal is what you invest, multiplied by 1 plus the rate to the number of years. So our amount will equal the principal. The principal is what you invest at the start. 154,500 pounds multiplied by one plus R. The rate is 4%, which is 0 0.04. So 1.04 to the power of N, the number of years, two years. So we let the calculator do all the work here. 1, 5, 4, 5, 0, 0, 0, multiplied by 1.04, close the brackets, to the power of 2, 1671072. So, one six seven one zero oh, seven two pounds. Just to maybe clear that up in case you didn't understand this formula, it's handy if you know this formula. If I just write down uh, after year one, he will have one hundred and fifty four thousand five hundred pounds. plus 4%, so 154,500 plus 4%, so I'm increasing by 4%, 1.04, that gives me 160680, 160680, so that's the end of year one, that's what he has, and then at the end of year two, he has 160, so 
is getting interest on this now to the value of 4% plus 4%. So I'm going to multiply that by, multiply my answer by 1.04. Increase it by 4%. And hopefully we're right. Uh, 167107.2. I did think that was a little bit large. 167107.2. I'm glad I checked that. So, 167107.2. And that's pounds. So, that's the question done in two different ways.